Hey guys, Shanti Phillips here with my brand new Dollar Tree Dollar DVD and Blu-ray hunting video. Yes, the Dollar Tree, so I've been told, has the Dollar DVDs and Blu-rays back in the store. And I've been calling the last couple days, you know, asking, did this, you know, did they come in yet? Did they come in yet? And then they were saying like, oh, it should be today, maybe later. Then I would call and they said, oh no, I think it'll probably be tomorrow. So it's been like kind of a back and forth. But from what I've been told, uh, they, I believe that they went out now and I actually see a sign up on the wall so this is the one this location though is always really good with having them but you can see the sign right there so you know fingers crossed they have some really different ones today I have no idea the ones they have this time around but like I said I've been calling a whole lot I might go to one or two other ones as well but this is one of those locations that always is really really good with them having them and they're also every time I call they're really helpful with like telling me and stuff like that but you know it hasn't been that long since the last time they had the dollar DVDs and blu-rays the new ones in I think it was like a little over a month ago or maybe only a month or so but like I said fingers crossed hopefully we can find some really cool ones today but we shall see into the first Dollar Tree we go But right here is where they would normally have them, like the deal of the week, and it's these solar lights. And usually the way to know is when they're going to have the movies coming soon, the solar lights are first and then the movies. But when I called, the guy said, though, they're actually in the actual section. And that's kind of how it is in here sometimes. Like sometimes I found they put them in the very front. Other times, in the front where I just showed, other times they're in the actual section themselves. So we'll see. Usually right around here is where they would have them. But it had the thing on the front with the pictures, so that means that they should have them. Yeah, they're, here they are right here, kind of like piled in here. Hopefully in here, though, are the new ones, and it's not like just a bunch of old ones. Like I said, they, they did have the, the thing there advertising them. I do see some of the ones, though, that I have seen in the past, though. So let's see, though, and, and usually I'm not seeing a lot of Blu-rays. Let's see if there's anything new in here. Like this, Ricky Smiley presents a Kingdom Comedy. This one, I know I've definitely not seen this one here. These ones I remember seeing like When the Heart Calls. This Rendell one. I don't know if I've seen that one. This one's kind of funny here. Uh, this movie, Home Invasion. What's funny about this movie is it actually has a quote from me in the, on the back. Smartest, most complex home invasion film in years. Sean C. Phillips, Cool Duder. So that's kind of funny. I actually ha already have this one, but really funny. Like this is like, I think one of, the, I think I had a quote on Death by Temptation. I, um, that was one of the other ones that Trauma put out years ago. Um, you know, their original DVD release, but that's kind of cool to see that one in here. This one here, Hollow Creek, this Burt Reynolds movie. I know I've not seen that one. The Fire, Next Time. Craig T. Nelson, I do, I do not know that one. This one I've seen pop up so many times. This um, Mind of the Married Man, this like complete first season. This is one of those ones that I've seen so often. This Fast Girls, that one I know I've not seen. Syrup, I think I've seen that here in the past. Let's see, Nine Dogs of Christmas. Yeah, I'm not seeing a ton of new ones here. Bug, we've seen that in the past. Um, Who's Your Monkey? This one here, this is another one I, I know I've seen in the past. Like I said, there's a lot of older ones in here, like Dark Horse, which is a good movie, but I know I've seen that already in here. Yeah, it's crazy there's not really many Blu-rays. Like, I'm not seeing any at all. This Gina Davis movie, Addicted to Happiness, I don't think I've seen this one in any of the past ones. But this bug movie, though, is actually kind of cool. It's one of those ones where it's like a, a lot of different characters and they all kind of collide together and like intersect and stuff. But this is actually a really, if you see this one too, guys, this is one I would recommend as well. Another Mind of the Married Man, Arthur, Arthur Newman, this Renee one, Speed Dating, Child Star. Yeah, nothing that different here. Hopefully I can find another location. It has like some of the Blu-rays because I here's one Blu-ray, this weird like bubblegum bu bubblegum fairies Valentine's Day sing-along, some strange, strange thing here. I do not know what that is. Weirdsville, I've seen that in the past. Two lovers, open road, another one of Dark Horse. There's anything explicit lies. I don't think 
I remember seeing this one here, this Rosario Dawson movie. It's come some like, I don't know what that is. Yeah, nothing that, nothing that exciting here this time around. Like I said, I have not seen, you know, um, pictures or anything of what people have found yet. But I think they're just starting to, oh, it's like kind of falling everywhere. Let's see if there's anything. What is this thing here? Ship, ship to uh, shore. 12, 112 top, top, top attractions on 12 world cruises. So some kind of a weird like cruise like thing. I guess like kind of like just video from like a cruise ship or something. That's kind of kind of interesting and strange. I don't know when this was produced. These kind of things are always kind of weird and like interesting sometimes because they're like can be so dated for like the time and everything. Let's see anything else? The ultimate ultimate legacy show business and the Nick Cannon one. Pretty bad actors. I know I've seen this. Yeah, a lot of these are the same. There's like nothing. I mean, I know they have that sign up front, but I don't see anything in here at all. Like nothing really besides. And there was only that one Blu-ray. So we're definitely gonna have to head to another location and hopefully we can find something better than the other one. But like I said, here definitely, definitely nothing very interesting. Uh, this time around though. Well, here we are at the other location. Now this location I just called and they said they put out the stuff yesterday. So hopefully there's still some left. You know, it's not like super picked over. But like I called this one yesterday early at like noon or something and they said, oh, maybe later in the afternoon this stuff will be out. So I'm not sure when for sure it actually went out. But yeah, like the last location though, that one really did not have much at all. And I feel like most of that stuff, except for like maybe a handful of stuff, was just old stuff. And maybe they had like one box and they just like scattered throughout a couple new things. But fingers crossed that this location hopefully has some better stuff, but we shall see. Well, yeah, I can see this stuff here and I actually see, um, you know, Blu-rays. Cause like the other one did not have Blu-rays and I definitely see some different ones. I have not seen like the train robbers, some John Wayne movie here. So let's go through all these ones and see. Some movie here called like four, three, two, one, four girls, three days, two cities, one chance. I do not know what this movie is at all. This is from 2012, this one released. Like I don't know anything about this one. Let's see here, Hoodwinked. I think, yeah, the second Hoodwinked movie. I remember seeing the first one in theaters and it was kind of like, um, it was like the animation in it was not amazing at all, but I kind of liked it a little bit, like the story to it. I've never actually seen the second one. I might get that one for a dollar. I might, because I, like I said, I have the other one, this uh, Howard Lovecraft one, Jingle All the Way 2 with Larry the Cable Guy. And I'm, I, I remember watching that one. I thought it was okay, but the original one I love so much. Uh, this one here, these ones, if you come across these, are ones I would recommend picking up because Broad Green Pictures is totally out of business. And a lot of these ones can be pretty rare. This one here is a Song to Song, which is a Terrence Malick one. I can't remember if this was the one that I liked. I don't think I remember liking this one as much as one of the other ones that he did that I believe Broad Green released as well. But like I said, if you guys come across these Broad Green ones, a lot of them are very rare. Let's see here. I see another one here, a Pillow Talk, this Rock Hudson movie. I don't have that one. That's not a bad price for a dollar. Wrong Turn Six, Last Resort. I can't remember if this was the one where they had like re you know recalled the movie because like in the movie there was like a poster, like a missing poster in it, and it was the person that actually had died, and the family like sued. I don't know if you guys remember that, but I think it might have been this one. Let's see another one here, Blu-ray of Draft Day. It's funny, it has a Walmart sticker on it. This like 1684 sticker on it. Let's see a uh, checkpoint here, uh, a Thomas Churchill movie here. So that's pretty cool to see in here uh, for a dollar. Great similar classics. I'm glad this location has more stuff because like the other one was so disappointing. This Atomica movie here. I don't know if I've seen this one here. This like um, Tom Sizemore movie. Uh, London Spy. The Facts of Life here. Some kind of like a wish kid this was a show i have this one but this is a show i as a kid i really liked it and it has like introductions by macaulay Culkin, and he does the voice in this one this was actually a pretty fun show as a kid i really liked 
see uh, The Last of Robin Hood. Oh, this is one of the ones I was trying to find. I saw last time around they had this movie, but I never saw it. And I never got to buy this movie, so I'm definitely going to get this one here. I'm just going to put this stuff so hopefully no one, like, grabs them or something. But yeah, this is one of the ones that I was hoping to find last time around, so I'm glad I finally see that, saw that one. Uh, the Unwilling here. I think I, re I think I reviewed this one. I think, I'm pretty sure I reviewed that one when that came out. Uh, this one here is a pretty good show. This ended, I believe, Dur Dirk Gently's um, ho uh, Holistic uh, Detective Agency. This is actually a pretty cool show. It only went for, I think, two seasons. Let's see what else here. Space Dogs, Another Unwilling, uh, Contract Killers, Implanted here. I don't know if I've reviewed this one or not. I don't, I don't think I have. Uh, slammed. Here's another one. I'm going to definitely get another copy of this. Uh, this is, I know this is one of the ones, it's a hard one to find, Neon Demon. And this is from Broad Cream Pictures as well. I have this one, but I like, I love this movie, so I definitely want to have another copy of that, because I'm like, ah, eh, since it's so rare. Immortal Wars, this is a newer one. 300, that's a pretty cool one to see. Burt Wonderstone. This is, this is one of those movies where I, I remember I have it, I, I have this movie, but was like never able to find it. So like, I don't know where I put it. And I actually really like this movie, so I'm going to get another copy of that because for, like, it's one of those few random movies that I misplaced. Ninja Turtles 2 here, Secret of the Ooze, which is probably my favorite of all the Ninja Turtle movies. This is one of, one of those ones I've watched the most. Like, this is actually a really, really cool movie. Like, my favorite of all of them. The Heat here, Training Day. This Grandma's Boy one is a kind of cool set here. It has Borat and Grandma's Boy. I can't believe that Borat has never come to Blu-ray. And I think you guys remember, too, when Borat came out, they talked about how they have all these deleted scenes and everything, and how they were going to release, you know, like a, another version of the movie with all this cut stuff, but they never did. I'm sorry, there's like a lot of weird noise in here, but let's see here. This movie, Gabriel and Me, here, I do not know that one. Dragons, Bus Driver, what is this one here? Bus Driver, Rod Forrester, do not know that one. Another Blu-ray here, uh, Lola vs. the World, I, I, I think... I think, people, I think people were telling me this was good last time around. This Greta Gerwig movie, did she direct this one? No, she acts in this one, but I, I remember people were telling me that was good. Ninja Turtles, the new one. Aurora here. This one. I don't think I ever got this one. I'll probably get that one. Moon Trap here. Let's see, uh, Dog Mapped. Yeah, I'm glad there's a whole bunch of new stuff here. Some dog movie. Griddle House here. Luke Perry, Natural Selection, Quantum Voyage, it's a movie with, never seen that one, Natural Selection, The Slider, Bone Falls, Jump or Die, there's a lot of new ones in here, Pastor Shepard, this was kind of funny, interesting movie with, um, I think it was a comedy with um, Danny Trail. I remember seeing that one when it first came out. Night Catches Us. I do not know what this one is here. Let's see. I'm trying to make sure I put everything back the way it was. Yogi Berra here. Digimon. Switch Miss. I think I've seen that one in the past. Dennis Leary. Dennis Leary. A syrup. We saw that in the other location. Secret Life of Mitty. That one has been on Blu-ray in here in the past. Another Yogi Berra. Three Dog of Tears one. Like this, like... I think it was like a, like a weird talking dog movie, I remember, like a talking dog Christmas movie. This one here, Where Was God, I don't I think I might have seen that one. Nick Cannon, Mr. Showbiz. Uh, this one, I know I've seen this one in the past, it's a uh, Jacqueline Phoenix movie. Uh, let's see, anything else new here, The Bug, they had that in the other location. Uh, Dark Truth. Let's see, here, Bachelor Party. I know I've not seen this one. Superman, uh, The New Adventures of Superman, two discs, 36 episodes. They usually have a lot of like animated stuff in here I've seen in the past. A League of Ext uh, Ordinary Gentlemen, some kind of like a like a bowling kind of documentary or something like that. Tim and Eric. And I, I always like this movie, the Tim and Eric movie, and it's, it's like set in a mall, and I always love movies that are in malls. Let's see, uh, The Neighbor here. This is one of those ones I think I remember buying, and then I never actually like watched it. There's like a couple movies like that, where I like bought them and never actually seen them. This here, let's see, uh, uh, The Curse of Robert here. There's like a number of different films in this uh, series here. 
Twilight, uh, Breaking Dawn, like a two disc. This is like a like a French Canadian release here because like half of it's in French. So that's kind of funny to see that in here. My so-called life. There's like a random volume of that. I never even knew that they released this as volumes. I know they released like the complete series. So yeah, like nothing else. I'm noticing at what size the ones I put over there. I don't think there's any ones I've missed over, but at least you know this location has a bunch of new ones though. Yeah, but luckily enough in there though was actually not a bust and they actually had a bunch of different stuff But like in there though, I got the incredible Burt Wonderstone Like I said somehow this one like got like misplaced or put into a box or something So I had no idea where it was and I always really like this movie and I love you know um, Movies set in Vegas as well like Vegas is like one of my favorite places to go So anything like Vegas I always really like and I said like I said this one is a really is a, is like really rare to come across now Anything broad green pictures the one I'm always trying to find for broad green is the um, Walk in the Woods on Blu-ray because that's a really ob obscure one. But like I said, all their stuff is, the company's totally gone. And I don't know if their stuff will get re-released by another company down the line. Uh, but like Neon Demon is like an amazing, amazing movie. If you guys have never seen that one, if you guys come across it in the stores, definitely a must pick up. I also got that one, uh, you know, See the Aurora one here. This Aurora movie, which I don't believe I ever reviewed or got or anything like that here and then I got and I know this is probably really bad but like I said I remember kind of liking the first movie a little bit like the animation was not great or anything but I remember like liking the story to it but I got the um uh you know the hoodwinked 2 and then this is the one that I saw people showing in like pictures and videos last time around like a month or so well the search party so I'm glad I finally found this one this is the one I really wanted to see and have never seen this one and the uh, on the last one I got was um that Lola versus movie which people I, I think I saw this last time around and people tell me this was a good one movie to get so I definitely uh, you know wanted to pick this one up if I saw it again but probably gonna head though to uh, like I there's like two more that I could look at the one I haven't called either of these ones so I'll See, just to see if they have anything just just you know because you never know and the, and the other two ones are ones that when I call they never really say too much so we'll see but at least I did find some cool stuff though into the third Dollar Tree we go yeah this one though has been really really picked over the last one though had like a huge amount this is like all there is it's just this there's some weird one here. Oh, this is like that Ellen Page movie, Ghost Cat. This one has like a different cover on that. I think there was one of these that had like a different cover than this. But like, I, I don't think I have this movie. And I remember this was like one of her early movies. I don't know if it was like a, I do not, I, I, now, I know I've never seen this one though. I might get that one. That's kind of a weird one. But yeah, this is the other one, that 4321 movie, Christmas Canyon, Griddle House. Yeah, so this one though has been totally ravaged. There's like really not many. Some movie here called Remember. I know I didn't see this in the other one. I didn't see this child story. No, I saw that in the past, but I didn't see it the other one this time around. Into the final Dollar Tree we go. And this one though, I don't see a thing on the front. And I see like those lights right there. This one though is usually like always kind of late to the party for things being put out, but you know, like I said, you see these lights? I'll look in the section over here and see. See, sometimes you gotta look in these boxes too because they could be like sitting there. I do, it looks like there might be some more stuff here. Do they have that cat one here? Oh, they have that. I didn't get this in the other one, um, so I might get this one here, this cat, but it looks like there is maybe a couple new things here, like Facts of Life season two. So that's the complete season here. So that's not a bad thing. I don't actually have any of these. And I, this is one of those shows that I never really saw many episodes of this one somehow. I don't know how, but it's like I never really like watched this one. I might get that for a dollar. I definitely am gonna get this cat one. Let's see though, anything else. They had this one in the, the one star dog napped. Tom and Jerry, Mr. Showbiz. This one I know I've seen in the past. Let's see, there's one Blu-ray here of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles here. Let's see, The Sacrament, I've seen that in the past. Dragons. Let's see, another Sacrament. Let's see what this one is here. That angel thing. This one, 
I like this one kind. It was okay. This bigger, fatter liar. Like I love the the original movie, but this one was like one of those like kind of goofy, bad like sequels. But it was kind of like watchable. It was like just kind of funny. Some of it. Let's see here. There's like a four, five movie set here of like um, I think are these Godzilla ones? I or are they Gamora ones? I'm not sure. Ones here. I, I know I've seen that in the past. The VHS. I've seen that in the past. Switch Miss, that one I've seen. This one I'm seeing a lot today, this 4321. Uh, Dark Horse, Hal, this is this is another company that's not in business anymore, this Alchemy. Um, and this was actually a pretty decent movie. Also, like this train. This one, the Cisco Kid. Monsters, Happy Endings. Super Fast, which was like the spoof of Fast and Furious. One of the workout ones. The other thing over here. Life Partners, that one was a pretty decent movie. Bug, Perfect Victims. Did not know this one. Christmas Trade. Yes, yeah, so that seems to be all the ones and only like. Oh, they do have one Blu ray over here, another Blu ray, Pillow Talk. So Pillow Talk. And I think I saw one other one somewhere, Lola, the one I got in the one, yeah, Lola Verse. That was one, one of the other uh, Blu-rays they have. And this is one of the ones I missed showing in the other store, uh, the Office Special, which was like, I think this was like, I don't know if this was after the show was done. I can't remember when this one was here. But other than that, though, it doesn't seem to be any other different ones here, though, as far as I can tell. So in there, though, I ended up getting that Facts of Life and that Ghost Cat one. But let me know in the comments below, though, uh, what you guys ended up picking up at your Dollar Trees. If you guys went to any stores, which ones you ended up finding, which Blu-rays and DVDs you saw. If you guys saw any different ones that I, you know, didn't see in any of the ones that I went to. But anyway, too, like I always say, if you guys enjoy these Dollar Tree videos, definitely give this video a thumbs up. Thanks so much, though, for watching and subscribing, guys. And I'll see you guys later.